The AI revolution is here. And with it come many new concepts. Big data, data science, robotics. I know, it's easy to get lost. But in this chapter, we'll start to unpack it all. Let's begin with the idea of big data. Essentially, it's the sum of all the data we produce. See, each time you use your smartphone, tablet, or computer, you produce data. And data are simply pieces of information. So for example, if you watch a YouTube video on your phone, it produces information about which video you just watched and the time you watched it at. Since you and I are using these devices along with many other people on the planet, we are producing colossal amounts of data. To give you an idea, approximately 4 million searches are conducted on Google every minute. In that same minute, 188 million emails are exchanged and 4.5 million videos are watched on YouTube. Now that is what we call big data. Perhaps you're wondering, okay, we produce a lot of data, but what does that have to do with artificial intelligence? Well, let's consider a virtual assistant like Siri or Alexa. The point of having a virtual assistant is that they interact with us, right? Essentially, we want them to receive our instructions, analyze them, and respond with the best solution. First, we give our assistant instructions. Things like, set my alarm for 7 a.m., or play some country music. Or we ask a question, what's the weather like today? Our assistant receives these voice commands through its microphones, and then it analyzes our request. And for that, we need data science. Data science is the field of research dedicated to all methods, processes, and techniques used to analyze data. In fact, it's thanks to data science that our assistant is able to sift through the massive amounts of available data in search of a response. Massive amounts of data, does that remind you of anything? That's right. Our assistant uses big data to identify an appropriate response. Have you noticed that we haven't once mentioned robots? The reason for this is simple. Our assistant is not a robot. I will say it again. Our virtual assistant is not a robot. Well then, what's the difference between robots and artificial intelligence? To be a robot, a machine simply needs to be able to move on its own. This means that a robot needs a mechanical apparatus and a computer program to operate it. However, this program does not have to include artificial intelligence. It could, but it doesn't have to. That is not its defining factor. Take an industrial robot that builds cars, for example. Its behavior is programmed from start to finish by a human. No artificial intelligence is involved. Now that we've covered several concepts related to artificial intelligence, let's see what AI is actually capable of. On to the next chapter.